my dad before the game, he called, he's like, he thinks one of us are going to dunk on someone before the game. And just to see him dunk in the first, the first or second quarter, I forget. And then me get the tip dunk, it's all good. You guys are already, after that Medina loss early, I mean, it's still early in the season, but how big is this for you guys to make up some ground as you try to establish yourselves in the conference? Yeah, it's definitely a big conference when we need it um, to make up for Medina and then going into Friday against Eastwood. So we just need to keep up the pace, stay in a roll, and just be poised and just keep up the keep up a good record in the conference. And that'll make our overall record better. Well, I really like the three that scored for us, um, Ryan, Ian, and Matt Bedell. I was going to say, you know, naturally Ryan and Ian are going to feed off each other's brothers, but it feels like those three feed off each other. Do you see that a lot from them? They do, and it's nice because you really can't key on one or two. And Ryan has been shooting the ball extremely well. You know, I, I feel comfortable if he got 10 open looks. Um, I just think we've got to get in games where um, the tempo is a little bit quicker and we're getting more shots in transition. I think Ryan Kahlo getting more comfortable as a point guard handling the basketball. I'd say in another three weeks, I think he'll be a different player. But again, if we could develop some depth and get each one of these young guys you know, feeling better about their game and doing more on the court, I said I, I'm really shooting for the end of January, beginning of February, where we're a different team and we can play against you know the best teams in the state. So you want to be definitely in the hunt, you know, come February. Our league's only 10 games, six teams. So, um, like I said, we couldn't afford. We lost the buzzer beater in Medina. And, uh, you know, Brunswick is 2-0. and This was a must early win. We got a tough week right here. We got Utah next and we got Iggy on Sunday. So it just uh, builds up the momentum and stuff like that and just gives us confidence. And, you know, we're learning a lot of new things. We're looking for depth for our team, two players off the bench. So I think this one definitely we boost our confidence going into Euclid and hopefully get 3 0 on this weekend or on this week. Is this a pivotal week for you guys? Definitely. Big, I think it's the biggest week of the season, I would say. Toughest week. Yeah, we, we talked about, um, you know, we were 5 and 2 coming in and you got to take care of business. And, you know, Iggy's had the strong preseason hype and you, know, you want to be able to definitely prove that, you know, you're one of the better teams in Northeast Ohio. So, this is a huge week for us. 